hi guys so this is what i do almost every single morning except on mornings when i can't get my lazy ass out of the bed but yeah every morning when i wake up i open up the windows i fold my clothes that were washed the day before i put them away and then i proceed to arrange the room arrange my clothes just put everything back where they're supposed to be i always like to fold all my clean clothes all of them and i hang the ones that need to be hung so in my house we basically run our towel system like how towels are being uh, handled in hotels we use all white towels and i don't think anybody has specific towels except maybe amarachi because she goes to school every other person we use basically the same towels but we change them as often as possible and we wash them with lots of bleach like my towels always smell of bleach and yeah that's basically how we run our towels we have lots of white towels we don't do colored towels because we all share towels okay And yeah, I go ahead to take out the towels that we used the day before, put them in the laundry basket, and I bring in fresh towels. So basically, we all use one towel in two days. Sometimes we use new towels every day, depending on how you know we use the towels. But basically, it's one towel for two days. And then after that, I go ahead to put on a video that I'll be watching while in the shower because I love to watch videos while in the shower. And I got this acrylic phone holder specifically for my shower. So before I enter the shower, I put my cleanser on my face and try to wash my face even though I don't rinse the cleanser out. I just try to rub it in. I'm using this cleanser from Bolden. I actually love it. Um, yeah, and then I go ahead to scrub my body before I then wash off the cleanser on my face. And then I go ahead to do my morning skincare routine, which is basically vitamin C, alpha abutin, and moisturizer with SPF. The moisturizer is from Bolden. And then I go ahead to wear my clothes and put some moisturizer on my lips it's just vaseline that i put in this little container i just use it to moisturize my lips and i'm ready for the day at this point i have aired out my room enough i have let in enough sunlight and fresh air time to close the blinds and put on my ac <laughs> I like my room to be cold okay yeah so i always close my blinds including the blackout blinds and then i put on the ac and my room is always cool and lovely to stay in then i go ahead to spray my room spray sometimes i skip this part depending on when last i use the room spray and then i take the clothes that need to be washed down to the laundry <music> So now time to spend some time with my kids i try to make them arrange their toys i was teaching sophia how to arrange her toys and she was excited because we made a game out of it although it quickly went south because she started playing more than i wanted and i had to leave her alone and then i went ahead to help my kids arrange their tables and clean their tables um yeah cora and eva basically scrubbed their tables from head to toe because their tables were very disgusting they had food particles and marker crayon marks on the table so they had to clean it and i just watched them and yeah they did a pretty good job i just showed them what to do i didn't help them and sophia is here cleaning up her own kitchen and washing plates as always <laughs> so next i go to the kitchen today we are preparing two soups and vegetable sauce um elizabeth has helped me prepare most of the things i need for the food i'm just here doing the mixing okay <laughs> that's pretty much how i cook she does everything she preps everything i need for the food and then i go ahead and just you know cook the food and yeah i was cooking vegetable soup okra soup and vegetable sauce 
and anytime i decide to cook soup i like to cook two soups at the same time two or more soups okay on other days when i cook i cook either two soups and one stew or i cook three soups or i cook stew and sauce for rice but today i'm cooking two soups and making vegetable sauce that we're going to eat with rice The vegetable I need for the sauce is green. I don't know what they call it in English, but now we call it green. <laughs> but green is English. But anyway, yeah, we call it green. It has a very lovely taste. And when you prepare it well, it goes really well with white rice. Um, yeah, so I'm just using this opportunity to also weed my farm a bit, just remove some of the weeds and then mulch. So mulching is using dry grass to cover the soil so that, you know, it doesn't lose moisture and you know the dry grass over time adds nutrients to the soil so i'm doing this this mulching also helps prevent weed from growing excessively like weed will still grow but not as excessively as they would if there were no dry grass covering the soil there so i'm just using scissors to cut off the leaf that we need for the sauce i'm also trimming out some um, damaged leaves or leaves that have been eaten by pests i'm just you know trimming all the plants so that they can grow bigger and healthier <music> that's it i'm done harvesting my vegetables i'm very proud of it like look at it guys look at how fresh how green how juicy these vegetables look i love it so we went ahead to wash all the vegetables we washed them thoroughly then elizabeth also cut the vegetables and then i came and made the sauce i already have this tomato and onions base um i'll show you guys in previous videos how i make it i always have it in my freezer and my fridge anytime i want to make egg sauce tomato sauce whatever sauce i want to make it makes a very good base it doesn't really have pepper because we use it for our kids as well so we add pepper as needed and at this point the white rice was ready so i just finished up the sauce very fresh i didn't cook it too much um, once i added the vegetables i put it off pretty much you know immediately and after that we went ahead to have lunch i didn't show this part because i was tired <laughs> So after serving lunch, I went to my office to continue doing some work. You guys, I just received a package from God is Good. I bought this, it's not two days ago, three days ago, from one seller on Instagram that I always buy stuff from. Her IG handle is cosmetic, cosmetics box underscore ng i think i've talked about her before and then her company name is the makeup storage company she's on instagram i ordered this on tuesday night she shipped it on wednesday and today is friday and i've gotten it um yeah so i ordered this thing this is a table 
What do I call this now? This is a table tray. So you can put this on your table, you can put it on your console or whatever you want to put it anyway. But here, I bought it because I want to put it here. I've been using this lazy Susan to put these things and it doesn't really look so good. So I bought this to just change it out. So let me just quickly change it out. Even though I like the fact that I could, you know, just turn this around, but I don't think I like it for my table. look alike this is a candle this is my speaker and this are also candles and scents and that's the diffuser <music> you guys where i'm going to keep this it's just to use and organize all my perfumes body sprays and all that and then here i'll put maybe my lip balms and some other things that are in my room anyway let me carry it there now so before i used to use this i don't want to call it diy lazy susan I made it myself. I just took two plates and I put some pearls, some beads in between them. So those are the beads. But well, you guys cannot really see them, but trust me, they are beads here. Yeah. So it was just pearls that I put here. And this was on top. And that made this rotate. But now I have gotten something better. So your own is here. Baby, your own perfume is here. Here. This is your shower. What else? Thank you. After arranging my wardrobe, I saw my husband pressing phone inside AC, chilling, enjoying himself. Ava was lying down beside him. He was trying to make her sleep and I was tempted, you guys. I just had to lie down for a bit just to relax my body a bit. Um, Cora also came to join us because she didn't want to sleep in her room alone without Ava. So she came to join us. On a normal day, it would have been Sophia with us on the bed, but Sophia has gone to sleep in her room. So we have Cora and Ava with us. And we just chilled for a bit and gisted and yeah that was it hi guys so i'm done for today um i'm feeling very sleepy i've just been yawning here but i need to edit this video and put it up i've been i've been yawning and it's just i think the time is almost five o'clock so anyway that's a day in my life i'm not even sure what i'm going to title this video but just pretty much a day in my life a typical day in my life when i have to cook um every other thing i think i do them almost every day but the cooking part is what I don't do almost every day. Um, and then the farming part, I don't harvest almost every day. So <laughs> those two parts. But I work on my farm every day. I, um, you know, do pretty much my morning routine. Um, that's it. Yeah. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed watching. And I'll see you all in my next video. Bye, guys. <laughs>